Welcome back to the pregame show here on the NECBL Broadcast Network. I'm Ryan Medeiros here alongside Matt Wood, one of the players of the game on Monday night's game. He went one for four with a two-run go-ahead double in the fifth inning to put the Gulls on top, and they never looked back, winning eight to four in a fog-shortened game. Matt, I have to ask you, how good did it feel to contribute to the win on Monday night's game? It felt great. Uh, I started off struggling at the play with two strikeouts. Uh, so I just thought to myself, shorten up, just put the ball in play and good things were happening. That's always been my approach. So, you know, once I saw the ball, bat, bat hit the ball, it felt great. Yeah, and you mentioned to me right before this interview that this is your first time in Newport. You played co college baseball about two hours away from your hometown at Penn State. Now you're almost triple that distance away from home. How have you been adjusting to life by the city by the sea? It's been great. Everybody here, my host family, coaches, players have made the transition very easy. Uh, it's a beautiful town. I couldn't think of a better place to be uh, playing summer ball. Yeah, last night you DH. Tonight you're behind the plate. You got a fair amount of experience at both those positions in your college career. Obviously, catching is a lot more of a de defensively demanding position. I want to ask you, when you're DHing, though, how do you maintain that focus in the game in between at bats? I think just sticking to my mental approach, uh, staying with the game, helping other catchers is one way that I really like to do it. You know, sitting, you know, on a chair or on the bench and just you know, being engaged in the game. And then when it's my time to come up to the plate, just uh, stick to my routine and yeah. Yeah, and let's stick on the offensive side of the ball. You had an excellent offensive season at Penn State this season. You walked 19 times, which helped boost your on base to about 396. How do you maintain that consistent approach and eye at the plate? Uh, it's just about trusting my process and routine. Uh, I really worked on it a lot over this past winter. Um, just being relaxed when I'm at the plate, getting pitches that I can drive and making sure that I'm not chasing. So you've been on the Gulls for about a week. I'm going to look at the catching side of things. You've had to learn a lot of new pitchers' repertoire since you've been here. How have you tried to speed up that learning process to make sure that you can catch these guys effectively? Yeah, it's definitely a learning curve, you know, hopping in and catching a bunch of guys, you know, who come from different programs, different methodologies. Um, I've just trying to been have fun with it, you know, try to learn as much as I can. Um, but we try to keep it simple and just make sure that they're developing, you know, they're working on what they need to work on, I'm working on what I need to work on, and just both having a good time at the same time. All right, that was tonight's starting catcher, Matt Wood. The NECBL Broadcast Network pregame show continues next.